Production and this is a video tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can shut off some of your Windows XP services so your computer will go a little bit faster. Again this is for Windows XP and Windows XP only so do not try in any other kind of operating system. Okay first of all we are going to go to the start menu and then go to run okay um, once you have your run tab open type in ms config and then hit ok this will open the system configuration utility um, there's several tabs here first of all you want to go to tools I mean startup and <clears throat> you want to look at the different programs to start when your computer starts. If they're check marked, that means they're going to start with your computer. Like I have Nero, and I don't want that starting when I have computer start. So I'm going to disc. I'm going to unselect that, and then this I don't need to start, and then I don't need that to start. And then you hit go down and hit apply. And then the next tab I want to show you is called the service tab. If you go here, you can see that there's um, a lot of different things. If they say they're running, that means they're running right now. You have to be very careful with this list of um, programs on a computer because some of them you do need. If it has yes by it, you cannot disable it because it does need it. But let me show the ones you let me show you some of the ones you can disable. Um, depending on certain programs that you install on your computer, different actions will appear that are running. See, LightScribe service is for the LightScribe thing on my burner. And that's running right now. It's causing my computer to go slower. Um, NM indexing service, I don't need that running. That's running. Um, I have not 32 as my virus section program. It's excellent, by the way. And that's running, and I do need that running. So I can disable LightScribe and this. And again, do not disable these unless you know what they are, because it might screw up your computer. Do this at your own risk. Um, wireless zero, I don't need any wireless things. Some of these things I probably don't know, like need, but like selected or running, but I don't exactly know what they do. Um, automatic updates, I don't need that. Windows Media Player, this doesn't disable Windows Media Player. It's the networking service, because Windows Media Player connects to the internet without you knowing. Web client, I don't need that. That's for dial up. I don't need that on um, secondary login. I don't need that. I don't need this going. I don't use remote access, so you can do that. A fast user, this is if you only have one user on a computer, you can disable that. And then that is pretty much all the things I found that I can um, unselect. And once you're done, you just go to here and click apply. And then you hit close. And it'll ask you if you want to restart. You can either exit without restart or restart now. Um, you will have to restart in order for the configurations to take place. So yeah. Um, this has been a video tutorial by BBB Production. Make sure to rate this video and subscribe to my YouTube.